Hey guys, it's Free Guys Up. I hope you're good. So today's video is a haul. So this is my witchy haul for things I bought over the past two months. So over the past months of quarantine. Um, a lot is from the internet, you know. And we can go out now. Things starting to reopen. So I got some stuff in store. So yeah. And there's two things that actually are not with me right now. Uh, one is a beautiful altar cloth, purple with moon phases and butterflies. I love it, but it's stuck at customs. Um, it was supposed to be here the 21st. Send them a, a message and they're like, yeah, stuck at custom. Here's your money back. You'll most likely get it when it gets there. And the other one is a book that was supposed to be here a couple days ago. It is, um... I believe it's called the dark goddess so i haven't edited the video yet and today i got this baby in the mail which is a book i told you like i didn't know when it was going to come uh it is journey to the dark goddess how to return to your soul by jane meredith um yeah that's it that's the book <laughs> uh the witch of wonderlust actually did a review on that book and that made me really want to read that so it should be coming at some point, but uh, this is full of stuff. Um, I'm going to start with these, actually. I got these for my altar, which is right here, which is a bookshelf kind of thing. Um, and I got these to put my stuff in because it was getting a little bit out of hand. So I'm going to just fish in and tell you. So, first of all, I have Wikipedia, which is this beautiful book here by Sean Robbins and Liana Greenway. I'm going to be doing a book review on this as soon as I'm done. I'm like a fourth in, a fourth or a fifth in. Um, for now, I can already tell you the review's probably gone bad. But uh, I got it because it was beautiful. And even though I'm not Wiccan, there's still things that interest me. For example, um, Sabbaths. I really love Sabbaths. And I'm interested in gods and goddesses. And any deity and things like that. So I got this here from Amazon. And it was, does it say here? $16.95. Everything I say is in Canadian price. So this was $16.95. Next up is, I love it this baby this is a marigold tarot this is a tarot i have in my purse at all time because i always have one um this is by amra grar and let me tell you the illustrations are so beautiful it's like mostly skulls and flowers that's literally like what it is for example like page of cups right here and here we have the tower, and let me show you a flower one. Oh, this one's also beautiful. The world. Rings are actual rings on hands, and the wands are flowers. So my favorite card is the Eight of Wands, which is just literally a field of sunflowers. And I'm going to try to find you a sword. The cups are school, the swords are swords, the rings are rings, and the ones are flowers. So this is a sword card. Oh, my favorite is not the eight, is the nine of ones. It's this one right here. So it is beautiful. Uh, I don't remember the price, but I'll be putting the price of everything in a corner or somewhere. Um... There's two additions to it. There's this one, and then there is the more golden one, which I've seen pictures of, but it's like $20 more. But the sides are real, are gold foiled, and the golden in here is foiled also. But uh, I really like it, just like that. And with this, there's no little guide, but you get downloadables with your order. Next we have, let's go with another tarot deck. <laughs> This is the Tattoo Tarot, which I have wanted since I started reading tarot. I wanted this as my, like, second deck. And now it's, like, 
Uh, I have like five decks. This is my seven, six deck, but if I count oracles, I have like ten. But um, I love that the guide is very small. It's not like a big book. And the pictures, like, I love traditional t tattoo style. So, like, everything is super beautiful to me. Also, excuse my nod, I just, I did them and I already ruined them. But, like, the Empress is very beautiful also. This is a sword card. I already showed you, you know, cup card. Um, these are what the ones look like. Let's just go and show you the ring. Oh, also, like, the people. I love traditional style. Um, I'm sorry, I'm trying to... Okay, the coins. Yep. Are like this. And my favorite card in here... Um, where is she? Is the Queen of Swords. If I can find her fast. So this is her. Oh my god. Okay, so, yeah. I got this one, which I really, really like, and I've wanted for a while, so I just treated my treat myself. Um, then I got some incense sticks from Walmart. These are the garnish sticks. I love them, and this is a pack of three scents. There's vanilla, raspberry, and cinnamon. Um, this is the only one I can find raspberry in. And raspberry is the incense I burn for Hecate. But I also burn uh, vanilla per for Persephone and also just for me because I love it. And cinnamon for um, Dionysus. I bought this. It was like three bucks. Then I got this book I've wanted for so long. I'm so excited. It came in yesterday so I didn't even take the time of really looking at it. But it is... The Witch's Book of Self Care. It is so beautiful. Um, did it say the price on here? Twenty two ninety nine Canadian. So yeah. Um, there is meditation incense that you can make prayer beads, meditation, balance, balancing, shrines, oils. It's just. I've wanted for so long, and like, I'm definitely, like, I'm gonna say read that one after Wikipedia, but no, I have two others to read. Next, I have, let's get these out, <laughs> flowers, <laughs> fake flowers. Um, yeah, I bended these so they can enter, but I'm probably going to cut them. So, we have these, which they call... Sunflower bush. I got these at the dollar store. I love the dollar store for that. And Lifa, Lifia, Midsummer is coming up. And it's going to be my first one. Well, my second one. Summon the craft. But the first I'm going to do stuff. <laughs> and I know, like, it's in June. But June is starting. I don't know. So I got these at the dollar store. I'm probably going to decorate my altar with. So I got this sunflower bush for 150 I got this, um, they just call it long stem foliage, but to me it looked like lavender, and it was, I think, two, no, 125. And then I got these, which I, they're so beautiful. I didn't even look at the price of these before buying them, and they're 250. But these are some carnations, and like, they're just very beautiful. I nearly bought like real carnations yesterday. Then I got, um, these rosemary seeds to plant, which I already did, so you can see, like, it's empty right now. These were 185 I want to say. I don't have the receipt with me, but, yeah, 185 was written on, like, the corner here. And it was, there was four left in the store, and we had to search for it. Good thing is my fiancé actually worked at that store in that section, so we found them. Next, from... The dollar store again. I got this big candle for four dollars. It's gonna be Persephone's candle. The candle she has right now is a uh, lilac one that I already was burning because, you know, I burn some candles, you know, and 
she just liked it. So it's hers, but it's running out because I was already um, burning it. So this was a $4 candle. It is 80 hours and it is a rosebud. And like, first of all, like, look at that. And it smells, oh, so good. So yeah, I'm very excited about it. Next, I have, oh, I'm going to show you these. I say it's switchy because I keep them on my altar because I'm not a smoker. But I have these little lighters. They were three, four dollar fifty. Like the things I can remember the price I'm gonna tell you because I have receipts. That this smells a lot. Um it smells good, so that's good. I got Juicy J's Thai Incense Stick in the scent Grapes Gone Wild for Mr. Dionysus. Um I burned one before. I was trying to not do it to wait for everything to come but like I'm filming today because stuff didn't the other book didn't come this week and I was like fuck it um but it's these it smells a lot like I got them and I when I opened the box there was multiple things and I could already smell that it smells great I burned one Dionysus was kind of confused but kind of vibed so I guess you liked it then I got these, these are basics for me, they're just Chime Spell Party Candles by Biderman and Sons. There's 20 in here, it was about 5 bucks, that's a good thing. So then I got this outer cloth, because at the start um, I had... 3D these that were supposed to be, you know, on the three little cupboards, and it was, was kind of cute. But uh, I have five now. Persephone and 80 just entered the chat. Um, so I got this altar cloth for Dionysus um, altar. But now that he's on my main altar, I think I'm gonna put it like I do Hecate's just a little square of it. But it's very beautiful, velvety, and I love the sides, and it's quite big. And I didn't know about that, but it came with a little pouch, which I'm so happy because I love the material and everything. It came with this little pouch here. So, you know, Dionysus' color are mostly red and, well, deep red and purple because of wine and grapes. And yeah, I'm definitely going to use the this one like for a rune or something or... Maybe my tarot can enter in that. Next, I have another cloth, outer cloth. I don't like the quality of this one. I thought it was going to be better quality, but... Because, like, the other outer cloths I have are, like, big and lovely, but this one is just, like, so small and scratchy. But it's okay. I still like it. Uh, this is Freya's. She's still in the cupboard, so I'm going to give this to her. <laughs> when Freya is here and wants to communicate, I get like a strong headache right out of nowhere. And I hadn't taken it out while she was with me S yet. But now she uh, sees it and she wants it. Also, there's runes and symbols and um, moons. I really like it for her. Next. We're, we're getting there. We're getting there. Next, I have this from the dollar store. This was $2.50. It's just a big thing of pink aluminum. Himalayan. 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 Pink salt. Uh, it's a grinder, so I have to find a way to get the top off of here, which I've been trying, and I just can't. But it's a grinder, and it's just... Very good to have this. And it's by Heavenly Spices. It's 380 grams for $2.50, which was good because the smaller one was like 100 gram and it was like $1.50. So double the quantity for not double the price. Um, then I got myself this bad boy. This is the Basic Witches book, which at the start was like, did they write this? Oh, I'm oh, sorry. Here it is. Did they write this as a joke or whatever? And like... When I read it, it's like, tap into your inner sorceress and channel the dark arts with this magical lifestyle guide for everything from powering 
of a stylist talisman to banish terrible tinder dates. But uh, I was like, what the fuck? Are they serious? There's like witches tree, hexes, talking about sex. Um, spells, covens. I got this, it was $19.99 Canadian. Again on Amazon. There's two things left. Okay, I got, I was so happy for this. The Witch of Wonderlust's little cup of magic zine. And um, I love tea. I love The Witch of Wonderlust. And I just took it. I thought it was $8 Canadians. But there's just like history and the lore of tea. Um, for references. Types of brews. Can do it with moon water. There's for each tea. There is little like out steep health benefits, kind of respondences, and a spell. So just amazing and meditation, divination with it. It is short, but it's amazing. I love it, and I love her. And lastly, but not least, I've seen this on. <laughs> I've seen it on TikTok a lot, and I was like, I'm not going to let them influence me. I did. It was this big book. It's A Thousand and One Spells. Complete book of spells for every purpose. And there's literally some for every purpose. Like, um, relationship. Oh, I'm going to go to the... Where is it? The contents, there's... Love magic, money magic, career magic, health and healing, holiday and traveling, fertility, good luck, uh, magic for the home, wish magic, magic for the season celebrations, animal spell, protection spell, friends and neighbors, just this piece, astrological angels, ages and stages of life, traditional, there's a lot. So yeah, I let TikTok influence me, and I got this, and it was twenty two ninety five Canadians. So that is it. That is my haul. Oh, there's a lot of stuff, but when I'm stuck home doing witchcraft nearly every day, looking at stuff about it, and now they um, you get deep down into it, searching on Amazon and everything. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed the haul and. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.